hi guys welcome back to my channel and if this is your first time seeing me on your screen welcome my name is Mudupe aka Modams and thank you for clicking on this video I know you must have clicked because you saw the thumbnail and you're like ah, this is interesting I want to see this Guess right, we are going to be doing something very, very interesting today. We are going to be doing sugar wax, sugar wax, sugar wax. Sugar wax. <laughs> but not we, I am going to be doing sugar wax, and you guys are going to be watching me do it. I just wanted to try this video because I've seen a lot of videos. I wanted, I really wanted to try it actually. I wanted to try it because it looks easy and it doesn't look that painful. And I just want to, you know, switch up from a removal cream. I just wanted to try something more, you know beneficial for the skin because they said it's good for the skin because it exfoliates the skin that's all the benefits that you can ever think of well you set for yourself before you do it i'm just going to be trying it out it's inexpensive guys how much is sugar you guys have 45p so we're going to be doing that shout out to Torera church actually for um inspiring me to do this video because i saw that she has three videos on her youtube channel and then i follow her on instagram anyway so she did a live during the old lockdown series and she actually did it like live so you could see how she did it i was like i'm actually gonna try this because it looks easy and it looks quite interesting so far she did the angle of it so there are like um pre and post things you have to do before waxing and after waxing so first off you have to not shower i mean you have to shower no that you um you had what am i saying you can shower but you have to wait three hours after you showered before you do the wax so what i've done is i haven't had my shower today literally it's literally like past 11 o'clock and i have not had my shower i'm coming to you guys barefaced everything so I've not had my shower because after after doing this, I'm going to have my shower anyway and I'm home all day. So we are going to be doing the sugar wax. I'm going to show you how I do it according to Tora's just recipe. And I'm going to link our video in the description box so you guys want to check it out. All our three videos. She has like full proof method. She has um, post um, sugar wax care. Like if you have ingrown hairs and everything. I don't think I've ever suffered from it before. I'm lucky. I'm rambling too much guys. Let's get straight into this video hi guys so in this recipe we're going to be using a very big pot you want to use your very big pot in your kitchen like your jollof pie pot or your party pot and in this pot we are going to be adding one cup of sugar then you'll be adding a quarter cup of lemon and then you'll be adding a quarter cup of warm water and when you add this you want to stir it into the pot so that the sugar and the water and the lemon are mixed together and then you'll be getting a very very special ingredient which is going to ensure that you create the same temperature sugar wax all the time it is this thermometer right here i'm going to link it down below in my description box and for this you're going to cook the sugar on medium heat and you want it to cook until it gets to hard boil and it depends on the temperature you are in your country you want to adjust this temperature to suit you I'm going to be doing mine in Adboy because I live in London and it's kind of summer-ish um, cold. I don't know, London weather is very bad, but that's what I'm going to be doing now. I'm going to be cooking this for about 15 to 20 minutes on medium heat and I'm going to be showing you guys how it looks. Bear in mind that uh, I got distracted about one minute and then my sugar went above Adboy for a bit and then it turned a bit brown, but it should use, sorry, I'm sorry, it should look light brown than this. So guys, I've done the sugar wax. This is what it's looking like. It's a bit brown because I let it go past the hard boil for like one minute. So it was already getting 
brand but it still looks fine change into something more comfortable i feel like this is so weird that i'm doing this like this might be a bit too personal for some people but my armpits are actually not that bad i'm just gonna wait for it to cool down and because i'm sweating i've got some tissue you know to dry my armpit some corn flour you know perspiration thing so that the wax can stick more i'm excited and i'm like scared gg because i'm just like oops like oops just wait a few more minutes because to cool down and then we are gonna get started so guys i've allowed it to cool for like 20 minutes and this is how it's looking it's still a little bit warm but it's gooey already oh i love this it's fun so i'm gonna take it and i'm going to knead it on my fingers it's gonna take a very small amount <laughs> it's sugar so you can eat it <laughs> what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna knead uh apparently this is how you need i don't even think i'm doing it right but you just have to stretch and pull back on each other stretch and pull back on each other and then yeah i'm just gonna keep kneading it makes that you know gooey sound that i love like gum you guys ready for this so i'm basically gonna put it against the direction of the hem so my hair is going that way so i'm gonna put it this way I do this armpit like this and it's so painful <laughs> I'm gonna need to take a break for like a week because I can't I cannot I cannot it was all a lot it was all a lot it was all a lot it was all a lie guys it was all a lie I have to pull from this angle Are you ready one two three I can't do this. I can't. Oh my god, it's coming out. Okay, I'm gonna try. My ears are coming out. Bad a lot. Now, okay, hair remover cream. Here I come. I didn't let the wax cool down. Whoa. Guys, look. Oh, that was nada. Oh my god. This is disgusting. I feel like now that I've gotten the main bits out, I can get the tiny tiny ears out. it's hard it's not for the light out it it's not the best like it's not the cleanest but majority of the hair is out like majority of the hairs are out well is this a case of next question or next ampit because i don't know how i'm gonna do this i don't know i cannot i cannot i think i'm going to end this video here because i don't think i can go through the pain of the second arm on camera because I just need to you know take like 20 minutes just to do that arm because i think this is my first time so that's why it's very painful and i let my hair grow for too long next time guys maybe you should do let it be i can't even speak anymore what i meant is next time guys don't let yours be as thick as mine let it be like very thin and like say two to three days i don't know how fast your hair grow but yeah therefore next time i wouldn't be letting it be used i'll probably do it every week now so that 
you know i get the very best result and i also don't have ingrown hair so i'm going to be you know applying some aloe vera gel i'm going to be applying some ink tea i've put that in ice cubes already i'm going to be doing i'm going to have a shower because i need to get all the sugar off my body if you guys have enjoyed today's video you know i don't know if you guys have enjoyed seeing me miserable on camera but on in pain but if you did if you do kindly subscribe for watching me go through this pain kindly subscribe and share with your friends so they can have a laugh because i think this is a very funny situation <laughs> i don't know for you but it is but i need to go now thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in my next one bye guys i can't even lift my arm <laughs>